How would you feel if you were the first South American artist in history to receive the most prestigious MTV VMA award after 17 years of not winning any? How would you also feel if everyone, including the biggest names in music, danced and gave you a standing ovation while performing at one of the biggest music awards? That's exactly how Shakira felt, as the Colombian singer and dancer conquered the world through her music and moves, becoming the highlight of the 2023 MTV Awards. But she had to pay a heavy price to get here. In this video, we'll tell you all about Shakira's historic VMA award and why it is a big win for all South Americans. We'll also consider her unforgettable 2023 MTV VMA performance and how celebrities like Taylor Swift reacted. We'll also look at the heavy price she had to pay, from her messy and humiliating breakup with Gerard Piquet to her legal troubles with the Spanish authorities. You wouldn't want to miss out on the juicy details. Shakira is definitely the most successful and famous Latin artist of all time, and her music videos are a big part of her appeal. With a music career that started in 1990, Shakira has won a total of 405 awards, including 3 Grammys and 12 Latin Grammys, making her the most awarded Latin artist of all time. Apart from her catchy songs, she's also popular for her incredible dancing skills. On September 12, 2023, Shakira made history at the MTV Video Music Awards, becoming the first South American artist to receive the Video Vanguard Award, an award given to artists who have made significant contributions to music and culture. She also delivered a stunning performance that showcased some of her biggest hits from the 90s till today. The performance marked her first time rocking the VMA stage since 2006 when she sang Hips Don't Lie with Wyclef Jean. Shakira's performance at the 2023 VMA was a combination of her hit songs She Wolf, Hey Felicito, TQG, Objection Tango, Whenever Wherever, Hips Don't Lie, and BZRP Music Sessions Volume 53. She wore a flesh-toned shimmery outfit that highlighted her sexy curves and her intricate dance moves. The performance showcased a celebration of Shakira's career and her Latin roots as she included Latin percussionists and knife dancing. She received a standing ovation from the audience and celebrities worldwide. The video of this performance has been viewed over 13 million times in just three days. That's how electrifying her performance was. Interestingly, in an interview with E.T., Shakira said she rehearsed the choreography and everything in just two weeks. One of the most notable reactions to Shakira's performance came from Taylor Swift, who was seen dancing and grooving to Shakira's performance from her seat. Taylor, who won nine VMAs that night, is a fan of Shakira and has praised her in the past for being an inspiration and a trailblazer for women in music. She was clearly enjoying Shakira's performance and showed her support by clapping and cheering. If Taylor Swift, the number one female musician of 2023, enjoys your songs, then you must be really good and have earned her respect. After the show, Shakira appreciated Swift through her Instagram story. But Taylor isn't the only one whose respect and admiration Shakira earned at the 2023 VMAs. Several other notable celebs were thrilled by her performance. Among such is the 43-year-old Brazilian model Giselle Bündchen. She commented on Shakira's Instagram post saying, Wow, what an incredible performance last night. You are amazing. Even Dolby Labs couldn't help but comment saying, This performance will be in the history books. And of course, it already is, as Shakira became the first ever South American artist to win the prestigious Video Vanguard Award. The only other Latin American to ever win it is the Puerto Rican American Jennifer Lopez in 2018. Apart from the Video Vanguard Award, Shakira also won the Best Latin Video Award for her song TQG with Carol G. Shakira certainly remains the undisputed queen of Latin music. Her fans were delighted by her performance and flooded social media with positive comments and reactions. Commenting on Instagram, a user said, Queen Shaq, thank you for representing all Hispanic-speaking people. You are a pride. Another says, I love her. She never ceases to amaze me. After all she's gone through and her fire is still there, the best performance of the night. Since Shakira's performance at the VMA, she has gone more viral than ever before. This has also rubbed off on several people, including an Indian instrumentalist who played Waka Waka on the Vena. But her increasing fame and unwavering fan support come at a heavy price, as she's still healing from toxic relationships and personal problems. In June 2022, Shakira announced that she was breaking up with Gerard Piquet, her partner of 12 years and the father of her two sons, Milan and Sasha. The couple met in 2010 on the set of Shakira's song Waka Waka, the official theme song for the FIFA World Cup. Shakira and Gerard's separation was last year's most dramatic and messy celebrity breakup. Thanks to the jar of jam Shakira left in the fridge, she would have never found out that Gerard was cheating on her. Yeah, you heard that right. A jar of jam exposed Gerard's infidelity. 
Shakira had traveled, and upon returning from her trip, she discovered that the jam in the fridge had decreased. Wondering who ate it in her absence since Gerard doesn't eat jam, Shakira discovered that PK had been cheating on her with 22-year-old Clara Chia. The most painful part was that Gerard and Clara had been dating for years, even before COVID in 2019. Shakira was emotionally and psychologically broken. This was when Shakira's beloved father was also hospitalized in the ICU. It was a devastating blow that sent Shakira's peace of mind into a whirlwind. She obviously ended it with Gerard, and that's when details of Gerard's toxic behavior started going viral online. There's a viral video posted by Shakira's fans in which Gerard's mom publicly humiliated Shakira by talking angrily to her. It was at one point she even grabbed Shakira by her face and silences her with a finger to her lip. All the while, Gerard saw nothing wrong in it as he stood beside the two women, calm and undisturbed. This reflects how much psychological and emotional hurt Shakira endured at the hands of Gerard and his toxic family. The worst thing was that Gerard never felt sorry for cheating on the mother of his sons. Ever since their separation, fans have continuously supported Shakira. On July 30th, 2023, Gerard was shocked when he took to the stage at a nightclub in Madrid while celebrating the end of the King's League. Fans began shouting, Shakira, Shakira. Gerard tried to ignore them, but the crowd started singing Shakira's song, Waka Waka. Angry at the crowd, Gerard lashed out at them and said they were all nobody, but that he is a world champion. Shakira did not speak much about her breakup, but expressed her feelings through her music. In her music video of Te Felicito with Rao Alejandro, Shakira referenced the jam discovery as she opened a refrigerator where Rao's head was placed. She also released a diss track titled Out of Your League, where she dissed Gerard and his new girlfriend. Fans loved it. She even performed the song at the VMAs. BBC reported that the diss track broke Latin YouTube viewing records as the song was viewed over 63 million times in less than 24 hours. In the last eight months, the video's been viewed over 617 million times. In the song, Shakira says she's worth two of the 22-year-old Clara. She also says that Gerard traded a Ferrari for a Twingo and traded a Rolex for a Casio. In a viral video, Casio responded savagely by tweeting, Shakira, we may not be Rolex, but clearly our customers are loyal to us. In defense of our Casio watches, the battery lasts longer than PK and Shakira's relationship. In an interview, Shakira told Elle magazine that the period of her separation from Gerard was her darkest period. The good news is that her father recovered from his critical condition. Apart from her messy breakup and father's critical health, Shakira also faced legal troubles with the Spanish authorities, who accused her of evading a whopping $17 million in taxes between 2012 and 2014. Shakira denied the charges and claimed that she was not a resident of Spain during those years, but of the Bahamas. The trial date has not been set yet, but if convicted, Shakira could face up to six years in prison and a hefty fine. Shakira's been through a lot in the past few years, but she's not let that stop her from pursuing her passion and caring for her father and sons. Shakira also spent time helping other Latin American artists to achieve stardom despite her personal problems. An example is her contribution to Carol G's career. Carol G's become the most successful upcoming Latin female artist in 2023 thanks to Shakira's help and collaboration in TQG. The video earned Carol G the only MTV VMA award she received this year. 2023 is undoubtedly the year of Shakira. Despite being 46 years old, she's looking younger and gorgeous than ever. Plus, her career has never enjoyed more fame and support from fans than it has in the last one year. Even her performance at the 2023 VMAs was amazing. But Shakira had to pay a heavy price before attaining her current career success and peace of mind. She emerged stronger than ever after leaving a toxic relationship, overcoming her beloved father's critical health scare, and even tax evasion charges. Shakira is certainly a devoted daughter, a loving mother, and a legendary musician.